Yo, what is going on everybody? Welcome back to, to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get stretched res inside of Fortnite in 2023. You guys remember back in Chapter 1, Season 7, I believe, all the streamers were using this really stretched out screen, which is actually called Stretch Res, and it gave them an advantage in the, in the game. So, Stretch Res uh, did get banned uh, like a few seasons later. I think it was like Season 8 or Season 9 it got banned. And uh, it it's kind of back. It's been back for a while, but it's not the same as it used to be. Back then, it used to give you advantages, like it would give you, I think it gave you a higher FOV or something like that. It, it, you can see more of your screen, but now it's just used for FPS advantages. So if you have a low end PC, um, it's good to have some like stretch res, and it'll, it'll give you good frames. So right now, uh, my stretched res is the native res, which is just like what everyone's game would be, and it's uh 1920 by 1080. But I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to get anything more stretched like this. So, um, what you're going to want to do is you want to make sure that you're on full screen mode, number one. Uh, yeah, make sure you're on full screen mode. Make sure you're on the, this resolution right here. And uh, then you, all you want to do is close your game. Now, once you have your game closed, all you want to do is go ahead and click Windows R. At the same time, it's going to open up this little uh, this prompt right here. All you want to do is type in percent local app. Oops, app data percent, and then you just want to click OK. And uh, now, what you want to do is scroll until you find Fortnite game. Then you just want to double click it, double click on save, double click on config, and then Windows client, double click that. And then now on game user settings, you want to right click and then click in the properties. And you want to uncheck read only, then you just want to click apply, click OK, and then OK again. I double click into the folder and you want to scroll all the way to the bottom and you want to look for this um, you're going to want to look for this right here you're going to want to look for uh, the resolution and last confirmed one and you want to change both all these numbers to your desired number. so I'm going to throw some of the uh, the stretch reses that work on the screen right now um, but the one I'm going to be using is 1440 by 1080 it's the one I've been running for the last couple of months and all you want to do for to do that is you want to change this number right here to 1440 and then this number right here to 1440 as well so just like that you don't have to change the bottom one because it says just stays at 1080 so i'm at 1440 by 1080 and then all you want to do to save it is click Control s or go on the file up here and then click save and then you can just click out of it just like that click in and now you can go back into Fortnite. So for me, since I'm on 1440 by 1080, when you load in, you're gonna see that it's gonna be blurry up here. And it's gonna be kinda like out like this. It's going it's all it's all normal. It's just part of the stretch res. I don't think it loads in like this if you're on normal res. So when you load in you're actually gonna notice that your game is more stretched out. And uh the main thing that you will realize is when you go to your locker how big the character looks compared to the normal res. Um, but other than that, you're good to go. You have you have stretch res now. Um, it's a it's it's a little bit hard to get used to at first, but after like maybe 20 minutes, I'm sure you're gonna be like absolutely clipping everyone. So I hope this uh hope this tutorial helped you guys. Uh, if it did, be sure to smash the like button and subscribe to the channel. It's free. It helps me out a lot. Um, and yeah, I'll catch you guys later. Peace.